It's the hottest dish in the streets. It's what everyone's talking about on Facebook. Twitters and Facebooks and all that stuff. It's what everyone tweeting about. Twitter stalking, Facebook groupie. It's time for Big Ticker's trending topics. Yeah, that's trending topics. Find out what's trending now with Big Ticker. Oh, he did not dump me for that. On V103. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, time for the trending topics. Bay and Yay versus the world. My goodness. So let's see. We gonna start. With, let's start with Yay. So Kanye apparently had some free time on his hands. And took Twitter to just talk about all kinds of things. Uh, a couple days ago, he said he was changing the name of his album all over again to T period L period O period P period. Hasn't said what it was, but kind of said if you could figure it out, he'd send it for you and you could come to the show in New York City tomorrow. Um, there's a bunch of guests online at v-103.com. People have tried everything like the Lord of Parties, the Life of Power, Legend of Peppy. Don't ask me. Tomato, tomatoes, lettuce, onion, pickle. <laughs> I don't know. Pizza Hut in the UK said, for the love of pizza. We have no idea what it means. Hopefully we'll get an explanation. Among those Twitter rants, apparently Kanye trying to squash Kylie Jenner's dreams of having her own shoe lock. Took the Twitter yesterday to share his feelings about his sister-in-law signing a seven-figure deal with the shoe company Puma. In his tweets, Kanye said, 1,000% Kylie is on the Yeezy team. He said he would give Puma back their money before warning them to never try to divide the family. I have no idea what's going on. Among those tweets, quote, Bill Cosby innocent. Screenshot a text message of a conversation with an assistant where he asked to invite Ric Flair, Hulk Hogan, and every awesome wrestler. An apology to Michael Jordan, who apparently declined an invitation to the show. I mean, you already said Yeezy jumped over jump man. And references to that Kylie Jenner thing I just told you about. So we don't know what's going on with Ye, but I just hope the album comes out tomorrow like it's supposed to because you changed the title. So how are you exactly going to have a print version tomorrow? We'll see. Let's go from yay to bang. Happened about three days ago, but Beyonce's controversial Super Bowl performance (laughs) continues to be buzzing in and outside the beehive. Groups of individuals were so offended by what they called a race baiting stunt and a slap in the face to law enforcement, they're planning to turn their passion into a protest. An online posting is looking to rally folks together for a demonstration outside the NFL headquarters to show the league that they, quote, don't want hate speech and racism at the Super Bowl ever again. Plan for next Tuesday in New York City. Meanwhile, the Beehive also planning something. A so-called anti-anti-Beyonce rally. Only the Beehive can come up with that. Uh, in the same place at the same time, pro-Beyonce folks are looking for a positive gathering where fans can celebrate Beyonce formation and the song's message. Meanwhile, meanwhile, Raven Simone had something to say about Beyonce's formation and Super Bowl performance that provoked plenty strong emotions from people and the Beehive. Let's listen to what Raven Simone had to say. The new video for Beyonce is hilarious and amazing and all the beehives coming for me, but I miss Beyonce singing a ballad in a dress. I miss that what? girl singing, because I've seen you dance, I miss you. What, where's no, Beyonce? You, that cannot, you, you cannot find dance. a flaw with Beyonce. Apparently, you can't find a flaw with Beyonce, but when you do, the beehive comes for you. All kinds of shots taken to Raven Simone. Uh, one of the funniest ones was, can you... Uh, Take her and Stacey Dash all the way out of the paint. <laughs> Y'all are messy. In any case, it still continues to be talked about, and you can still see all of this particular trending topics and everything. Beyonce and Kanye at v-103.com. That's going to do it for the trending topics right here on the People Station V103. 